Well, hello friends. This is it. We made it through 52 weeks of sharing the messages of my husband's Seek and Find Art. You know, there's actually 72 of these, so check it out on our website. <laughs> but I think I have saved one of the best for last. If My People was painted in 2002 after 9-11, Jack wanted to do something as a memorial to that tragic event, but it became much more. It became a call to prayer and a return to God. We need that even more today than we did almost 20 years ago. I filmed Jack explaining the message of this painting when we were at the Great Passion Play. And I know you will enjoy hearing the artist explain what prompted him to paint this painting and explaining the messages that he intended for this painting to have. Now the audio isn't the best, so you might want to turn on closed captioning. And it was not too long after the 9-11 attack on the World Trade Center. That prompted the thought about doing something as far as remembering that day, not the day so much, but the people that we lost and the families that were impacted. Mm -hmm. So I knew that the, there would be some hidden thoughts there. And uh, then it began to develop and took a turn that I wasn't planning on because I thought this was going to be a founding father perhaps mending this flag. But one thing I knew that I knew the flag would be there. I knew it would be tattered. I knew it would be under stress. Um, but uh, and I knew the towers, the event of that day would be there as well. So first thing you would look for is the twin towers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then you, when you come off of those towers, you almost see the smoke that was coming yeah. up off of them. But it forms like a face in agony right behind yeah. you. So this reflects what happened that day when it was Pennsylvania, yeah. you know, at the uh, Pentagon, all of the tragedy of that day, mm -hmm. with the lives we lost and the people who were part of affecting how this nation was. We won't forget it. We just need to remember. Um, those who were lost and since then many more. Mm -hmm. But as I was working with this, I went down to the next area and you'll see a little child here. Mm -hmm. But this is simply saying that in God's eyes, life is precious and all is given for all the power of that might be. And where this began to change for me was when I was working on the hands. And again, I thought that maybe a founding father. And so I was laying this composition out. I came and I began to work on that left hand. I came to back underneath that sleeve. And I began to work on it. It became kind of like a smudge. And all of a sudden, I thought, if that's not a smudge, but if that's a nail branch, this whole thing changed because of that's Christ reflected in this flag based on this on that scripture in the Old Testament. And I'm talking about if my people, which are called by name, my name is the Lord of pray, seek my face, turn from evil, wicked ways, I'll hear from heaven. And he goes on to say, and I will heal their land and restore them. And so when that came, the title of the painting, If My People Came, and then the values that are in that verse also became very important. That's where the life issues came from. Life is precious in God's eyes in any age. We need to value that. It calls on us to pray. And so you'll actually see people praying, three of them, in that bottom, in that bottom white panel. But there's some opposition to this. You'll see in that dark triangle, you'll see almost a presence of evil. It's like a spiritual warfare. And this, this evil lurking in this area here, this spiritual warfare that's taking place is really pulling at, at this fabric, this freedom that we enjoy and we can't take it for granted. But it goes on to explain that, it goes on to explain that these hands really represent redemption and sacrifice. And you can see the sacrifice through a cross and the Lord mending the nation and he gives us one life at a time and he gets to put us back together as a nice work. But again, the tattering and the tearing, that could be apathy or more of a life of the values or system. We need to value what he values and so that's why there's all the other elements around there. 
and so that's how this painting came right. out. It shifted right. to found it all to the yeah. Christ. It is our prayer that this painting will be used to draw many to God through faith in Christ. He is our only hope. God bless America. Stand beside.